The new Amador project is a development that will be located next to the historic Amador Hotel at the current location of My Brother's Place Restaurant and Billiards Parlor. Max Bauer, vice president of GMB Development New Mexico, says this will be the largest development project downtown in decades. The, the plaza work has kind of gotten the ball rolling and there's been more and more interest in doing things downtown. What's unique about the Amador project is it, it combines a lot of goals in one shot. We're taking care of a, a office space needs for the Convention and Visitors Bureau. We're doing work on the historic Amador Hotel, which will bring that building back into uh, to producti you know, to pro productivity, if you will. And, uh, and then, of course, adding services and venues downtown for, for everybody. The new development will have space for restaurants, retail, and a live event venue. City Councilor Greg Smith says this is an important project because this is the gateway to downtown. We will see uh, the excitement downtown, we'll see the opportunities, we'll see the Amador Hotel uh, appropriately rehabilitated and uh, you know, historically preserved, and we'll see other activities down there. So I, I think it all ties in with things that we've been wanting to happen, and certainly it will sort of link in with the two-way uh, conversions that we're doing on water and church and the completion of the plaza and, and several other things. So it's exciting. Mayor Ken Miyagashima says the new restaurant and retail space can help draw more business and development to the downtown area. Well, you know, one of the things that our uh, developer was telling us that the consultants that they work with on the 10-10-10 rule about having different types of venues of the same type, uh, 10 different restaurants or 10 different pubs to, to draw from, 10 different retail stores. So it's important that, that the public have a variety when they come downtown. It's not just one or two things. The city is spending $6.5 million that will be paid to GMB in stages as construction work is completed. At completion, the city will own the property. Max Bauer says they have already heard interest from businesses looking to rent the space. We have uh, several tenants uh, that are already uh, issuing uh, letters of intent to uh, essentially uh, be in a position to take the space down once it's complete. Um, we're still working on the plan, so we got to get through the balance of the plans first so that they can see what they're leasing, but there's a lot of interest. and. Um, I think that the leasing of the space is actually going to happen a lot quicker than was originally anticipated. The project is still in the planning stages, but Bauer says they are hoping to have the project completed by October of 2017. For KRWG, I'm Samantha Sonner.